Today I'm going to be trying to make a beat in the style of Nines' new album called Crop Circle 2. The reference track I'm going with is Tony Soprano 2. Honestly, there's a lot of sampled stuff on the other album and I've been doing a lot of sampled stuff recently so I thought I'd switch it up. I've been making Nines type beats since I was like, I don't know, 14, 15 years old. So realistically, I should have enough practice at this by now. But yeah, let's just see how it goes. Let's make a start. The most stereotypical Nines type beat that I can think of is like 160, 170, 180 BPM, something like that. I'm probably going to go with like 168, something like that. I may actually start out with the bass this time. Man, I'm gonna change the FL Studio theme. It's too bright. White light it hurts my eyes. I'm a producer. I can't go outside. I think I'm gonna take that and bounce it out and see what it sounds like. Okay, I'm gonna add some effects to that later, but for now I'm just gonna move on to the vocal drops. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. What if I take this one and I reverse it? Alright, we're gonna take all of the melodic elements, we're gonna mix them now. I've mixed and arranged the melody and this is what it sounds like now. Alright, that sounds really good to me, so I'm going to start with the drums now. The drums are going to be pretty simple. Already there's so much going on in the melody, you can't make the drums too complicated, otherwise there's no room for an artist, you know, so... Bro! I'm gonna lay that with another snare, I think. that one symbol I always use.
I'm happy with the drum loop so far, but I might actually add a live drum, so I'm gonna need addictive keys for that. I use the same one every time. All right, we're gonna bounce this one out and then I'm going to add like a more fast paced one. All right, now we have all of the drums, so I'm just going to mix and master them and see how it goes. All right, finished mixing the beat, so now all I gotta do is arrange it, and I think we're good. I don't know how this beat should start, actually. I don't really have an intro idea for it. Wait, bro, I just realized I had two versions of the bass line going at the same time. What am I doing? Anyway, continue. And the beat's done. Overall, I think the beat turned out really well. I'm really happy with the vocal chops. Bass line, I'm very proud of. Really stereotypical, some sort of like pot of paper and nines type sound. I could do a little bit better with the leveling on some of the vocals. I'm not gonna lie, some of the effects are a bit overbearing. But other than that, I think it's all good. Hopefully, if someone needed some inspiration for a beat that sounds similar to this, this video helped. Feel free to subscribe and like the video if you want or don't. I don't mind. Let's just listen to the beat and see what I can improve on for next time. Mm -hmm.